Hello guys. Uh, so the next topic is uh, 1.2, title, number, systems and representations. At the end of this topic, students will be able to explain how the data is represented in the computer. Number systems are the techniques to represent numbers in the computer system. To understand how a computer processes the data, you should know how a computer represents data. Human speech is analog, but the computers are digital. They recognize only two discrete states, which is on and off. This is because computers are electronic devices powered by electricity, which also has only two states, on and off. We can also that we can also say that computer use a binary numbering system to represent the data or to represent instructions by translating the letter or words into a number. Computers are electronic devices powered by electricity, which also has two states, on and off. The two digits, 0 and 1, easily can represent these two states. Take a look at the figure 4.12. So the on represent as a 1 and off represented as a 0. So digit 0 represent off. It shows absence of the electronic charge. While digit 1 represent on, it shows presence of an electronic charge. When people count the numbers, they are use the digits in the decimal system. For example, 1.9, RM, 30, and so on. But the computer used the binary system because it recognized only two states. The binary system is a number that has two unique digits, which is 0 and 1, and it called bits. What a bit? A bit, uh, short for binary digits, is the smallest unit of the data that computer can process. As you can see as an example, 1, 0, base 2 contains 2 bits because it is 2 digits binary, while 1, 0, 0, 1 contains Four bits because it is four digit binary numbers. When eight bits are grouped together as a unit, they form a byte. For example, one one zero one zero zero one one. A byte provides enough different combinations of zeros and ones to represent 256 individual characters. These characters include numbers, uppercase and lowercase letters of the alphabet, punctuation marks, and symbols. The combinations of zeros and ones that represent characters are defined by patterns called a coding scheme. We will discuss this in the next chapter. Bits and bytes also used to measure storage capacity and internet speed. For example, 
bit is used to measure transfer rate such as kbps mbps and others while but commonly used as a storage capacity such as kb kilobyte megabyte gigabyte and so on how a letter is converted to binary form and back For step 1, a user press the capital letter T on the keyboard, which in turn creates a special code called scan code. Then, the scan code for the capital letter T is sent to the System unit. After that, the system unit converts the scan code into the capital letter. It will convert scan code to its uh, binary code. Which is 01010100 as an example. And stored in the memory for processing. After processing, the binary code for the capital letter T is converted into an image. And displayed on the output device such as monitor. Before we proceed to the next topic, you need to answer some questions below. You are given about 10 minutes to answer. You can make a discussion among your friends. You may start now. <laughs> 